Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Keep in mind, Cancer, that I am live here every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You could ask questions at the live session or just come for the collective reading. Also, I have tarot classes now. The link will be below. Um, and I have an Amazon wish list for the holidays. If you feel moved to uh, purchase something from the Amazon wish list, it is always greatly appreciated. So let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Cancer with a clear, concise message from you. Let's see what the week holds for you, Cancer. All right, let's see. What does the week hold for Cancer? Okay, two cards coming out. Money, blonde, female. All right, so uh, maybe somebody who is a little bit younger than you. Um, you could be the young person. There could be some money coming into you. Uh, maybe from a past love, maybe you're reaching back, you're asking for money or someone's asking you for money. It could be younger female, or this could be you. It could be someone, of course, from your past, maybe it didn't work out with. There was a breakup or heartbreak. Um, there was a breakdown in communication. Someone could want their money back is what I just heard, or uh, vice versa. Someone is asking for money here. Um, so it could also be that... Um, Somebody is dealing with somebody that could be a gold digger or they only come around for money. Um, somebody is in need of money, so they, they go down the contact list trying to reach out to people or love past loves to, um, you know, see if they can cipher or siphon money from them and see what they can get from them, finesse them, whatever the word is, you know. But it's like they're they're digging, you know, uh, to see where they can get money from, where they can get resources from. Uh, no intention of actually maybe uh, sticking around or being in any type of relationship, but it is definitely one-sided. It is someone in need and uh, there will be a taker and there will be a giver. Let's see what the advice is for you, uh, Cancer. What's, okay, the advice, yes. So somebody definitely will give you money or someone will hit you up for money. Um, if you don't know if you're ready, some, somebody also could be trying to like um, impress you with money, giving you a gift, a gift of money, someone from your past, or you may be trying to return to somebody, a younger female than you, um, maybe trying to uh, woo them with money, uh, buy them something or, or just give them money or, or uh, maybe a really expensive gift here. We have a yes answer. Yes, you're ready maybe to go towards this person or you're ready to ask for something or you're ready to uh, embark on this uh, journey. Maybe you've been thinking about it. You've been kind of stir crazy about should you reach out um, or will this person reach out to you? Some of you are realizing that there's some woman in your life who is a gold digger who is only there for the money. And now you want to go back to your past here. You want to go back to a past love. Uh, you want to reach out. The cards say that you're ready. And yes, you should. Let's see what the outcome is this week for cancer. What is the outcome for cancer? All right. Okay. The page of swords. So it looks like you're just going to do a lot of spying or someone spying on you. Um, it can be any via any mold of spying, tarot card readings, um, of course, social media asking around about you. Somebody is really not trying to talk or have full on conversation because they want to refrain from the petty arguments. Also, there's still somebody holding on to some deep seated issues. Um, they're not ready to let this go. Also, um, there could be someone still holding on to you too, Cancer. Uh, someone definitely is trying to. I don't know. They're trying to give some younger female around you money. Maybe your child. They're trying to give your child a gift or something very expensive. They're trying to bring you back in. Um, it says you're ready maybe to even move on. Yes, answer. Yes, this person is still holding on to you. Yes, they're still spying on you. Yes, they still inquire about you. You have a, a Aquarius here. Um, in one to 11 days, something could happen. You could receive a message. Somebody is really thinking about what to say to you or vice versa. This is what you're doing in terms of trying to go back to someone else, a past love here. Um, you know that your words need to be uh, precise, uh, direct, accurate. Okay. So it's like a really a mental cerebral type of relationship where you both have to kind of like think of what you'll say because 
this person is ready and you're ready. And um, that's what the nature of the relationship is. It's almost as if somebody feels like they need to dominate or be domineering in the um, conversation and coming back to another person. There's also somebody inquiring about if you want to start this up again, whatever it may be, a relationship, um, a secret affair. If, you, if you're willing to start it up again here, if you're willing to come back into some toxic stuck stagnant relationship here that has very little growth so uh you could be wondering if someone wants to come back to you cancer or vice versa someone's wondering if you will go back to them so this is what i have for you this week if it resonates for you let me know how it resonates for you if you're going to be receiving money or someone's going to buy you a, an expensive gift if you've asked for it or you just know that they will do so um comment below Put the gifts down in the in the comment section. If you know somebody spying on you here, put some swords down there in the comment section. If you're spying on someone else here, if you know that the conversation is always tough when you deal with this person, um, yeah, put some uh, swords down there in the comment section or put some of those uh, little mad emojis because, you know, the conversation always goes left when you talk to this person, okay? Um, if you want this person back, if you want to reach out to this person here, um, write yes down in the comment section. Let's manifest corporately the things that we want. If you know that uh, you want money or money is coming into you, or you know this person is going to buy you a, a large gift or give you money, uh, you're expecting it, you deserve it, you ask for it, uh, or maybe someone's repaying you. Put some money, put some money emojis down there in the comment section, okay? Um, Cancer, this is your reading. Do keep in mind that you can go over to the website, book your own reading there if you're feeling moved to do so. Keep in mind I'm live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night. The tarot classes are linked below. And you could buy me something from the Amazon wish list if you're moved to do so. Also, you could buy me a coffee. If you took something from the reading, you could give back. You could buy L a coffee. The link is below. It says buy L a coffee. Thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.